Okay, Michael, how uh, did you come to be uh, affiliated with this group of folks? Uh, just a bunch of citizens. We kind of got together. We all like getting out and riding our bikes and riding to school and, and to other attractions. So we thought that uh, Wilmington is the perfect town. It's flat. The climate is perfect for, uh, you know, other modes of transportation other than taking a car. So what we're trying to do is get more awareness and uh, out there and get sidewalks and bike paths, you know, put in so we can get to school and go to the beach, go to the shopping areas and tie in with the Cross City Trail in Wilmington. Okay, Michael, and how did you and Peg um, get together and, and uh, start working on this grassroots movement? Uh, we met one day at her house. Uh, there was a, a sign out there about getting getting together anyone that's interested, and and uh, five of us originally showed up, and then uh, Adam came along afterward and helped us out, put a website together so we can get petitions signed, and we're real close to uh, a thousand signatures on this petition. <laughs> okay, everybody, we think it's pretty exciting that everybody came out again to ride, and we want to let you know that the DOT of North Carolina and the County Commission have promised us $200,000. Cool. And that's a lot of money and we're really glad. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not put a damper on it, but that will basically get us from military cutoff to Old Fort. Okay, which is still back in Gorman Plantation. So that doesn't quite get us even to the school. So the job's not done, but we've got a great start and a beautiful day to ride. So thanks for coming out. Let's go ride. All right. All right.